Hi everyone, welcome back to Rachel's Enchanting Cakes. Now today I'm going to show you how to cover these beautiful love heart shaped cake dubbies. Also using the cake lace technique that you can see here on this dummy step by step. In order to cover this cake dummy, I am using the sugar paste and the cake dummy is exactly 8 inches deep by 8 inches wide. Start by dusting down your surface with some icing sugar and roll out the sugar paste so it's lovely and thick. Now using your rolling pin, simply lift up your rolled out fondant and place it over the cake dummy that has been covered with cooled down boiled water. You now want to negotiate the pleats, smooth out the sides and cut off any excess fondant. In order to cover the inside of the cake, here I have rolled out again a very thin piece of the sugar paste and you want to cover one half at a time. So simply fill the inside of the cake dummy with some cooled down boiled water, place your sugar paste over the rolling pin, add it to the bottom half, neaten it, neaten it out and cut off any excess fondant and then we will flip this upside down and repeat this process for the top half. This will just avoid gravity from pulling it all away from the cake dummy. Now simply repeat this process once you have turned it upside down and you will have your perfectly covered heart shaped cake dummy. And we can now start with the cake lace. Today I am using the Oriental Blossom and Birds Cake Lace Mat and here I have a spreader. Now you can use the colours of your choice. I am using some ready-made cake lace products. Here I have the beautiful pearlized pink, the lovely pearlized gold because I think these colours go together really well. So just choose which parts of the mat you want to cover with one particular colour. And then simply use your spreader and go over these sections, making sure they are completely covered. Once they are, leave this to set. I like to leave them to set naturally or you can place them in the oven for a short period of time on a low heat. Just follow the instructions on the actual cake lace product that you are using. Once your cake lace has set, it will come away from the mat very easily. So here I have some baking parchment and I simply flip the mat the opposite way round and gently peel everything away. We will then be applying these to the cake. And for the butterflies that you saw at the beginning, I used the Madame Butterfly cake lace mat and I just used one section and the same technique that you can see here. In order to add the cake lace to this beautiful cake dummy, I am using a steamer. Now these are a great investment. However, I understand if you're relatively new to baking, you may not have one. You can just use a small amount of edible glue. So simply steam the cake, add one piece at a time where you think it looks best. I start off with the oriental birds and blossoms pieces first and then the butterflies that go in the centre because they have been left to set beautifully they stay and look gravity defying. Cake lace is a wonderful product to work with it's simple it's easy but so so striking and effective. I hope I've helped you all again today guys there'll be more new tutorials in the new year Merry Christmas and I'll be back soon.